Uh, class has been great. I did really well in those. Um, they weren't too tough, but it was a good way to kind of adjust to college life. And then other than the workouts were a lot of fun. It was tough work, but I mean, you can definitely tell it helped. Uh, classes were pretty good. Um, I took a lot of AP classes in high school, so uh, coming in here, I was a you know pretty good student, and um, I did well in my summer classes. We got A's in both. So I'm going to major in sports management, and then afterwards, I plan to go to law school and be a sports agent. Classes weren't bad. Summer school, uh, they say summer school is a little easy, but once we get into the uh, the real academic year, it gets pretty tough. So we'll see. We have a lot of academic people on our side, so that helps a lot. My experience so far, I mean, college is real different. It's a, it's a much quicker pace. I mean, I ain't expected way different from high school. But my hopes is to make it on that trip September 3rd and play on that field in California. The um, experience been good, just getting used to everything. Everything is on the schedule. I'm not quite used to it, but I like it. I'm enjoying myself, learning all the new formations, new plays and stuff, getting acquainted with everything. Um, it was it was quite eye-opening, you know, to move real fast, but, you know, after rep repetition, repetition, you get kind of used to it. And I think by the end of the week, I'll be all right. Just getting used to it right now. You know, after the first practice, we got out of the way. And some of those jerseys are gone. And, uh, Starting to pick up the little things, pick up the plays and whatnot. My game, I'd probably just say, I just want to get the whole defense, defense schemes down and everything, just more the intelligence part of the game. So I'm just working on that and the plays and everything. That uh, that should be good. And then uh, as a person, I mean, just just learning how to get over mistakes and stuff like that in, ga in games and everything. So if I uh, make a mistake in the game, people uh, forget it, have a short-term memory, as people like to call it in the game. So just so I can continue to keep playing. Coach Kill, uh, you know, a great coach. He's uh, definitely a player's coach. Uh, he has no problem jumping our case, which I have no problem with either. Uh, but you know, he pushes us. He pushes us to be the best we can be, and he expects us to win. And that's that's what I love to hear. Uh, it's been it's been pretty good. Uh, definitely, you have to put a lot more time in. It's basically transferring transferring what you see in the film room, in the study room, on the field. That's that's the big thing. Um, the linebackers, is it's real good. We got some older guys that likes to teach. I mean, most guys don't like to teach, but all the older guys here in Minnesota, like such as Mike Rallis, Gary Tinsley, uh, Brandon Bill, all those guys have been helping me through the process, and it's made it a much easier job as a college linebacker for myself. All the tight ends are real close. We, uh, we eat the meals together, and uh, we kind of do things together on the weekends and, and stuff, so gotten pretty close to the tight end. Um, our, our room with it, another DB, fellow DB, all of us are close. You know, the older guys do a good job of helping us out with anything we need. You know, anything we're not sure about, they'll talk to us and mentor us. So I think as a unit, we, we're pretty close. Most of the rest of the camp are to just keep learning, keep grinding, and uh, you know, just keep working hard. Um, just to get better, get better with everything, technique. Uh, everything. I just want to improve, knowing the plays, you know, just going into the season, getting ready, trying not to worry about playing time, just worrying about making myself better every day.